since we already know our assessment instruments we're gonna go with the next one which this is the first one i put after assessments would be your age um six seven scalar that you can see it right here and that is the for anterior um teeth because it's simple shank and then is the point and you can see that right there then i usually do well i'm going to start doing and setting up my posterior the other um scalar again it's a point let's see there we go it's a point and then this would be your s204 and then we can see it right here then on my other end i would do my bernard first because andy bernard from the office wants to be first that's why it reminds me of and this one has a longer like this shank right here the terminal one is longer and then you can see right here the sb and then one two you can see it right there and then the next one uh, that I'm going to put them in order, I'm going to do my Macaw, um 1718, and that's the round one. This is the only round one. And then I believe she said, I don't know, don't quote me on that, that that one we um, wouldn't use for like our partners. This one's for more like severe, like because we usually have healthy um, gums or whatnot, but this one is circle. So that's the macaw and this is the only one that looks different and the name is different that's what i remember then we're going to go with our columbia 1314 because this one this is maybe not the best i think this one works fine the little terminal shank is smaller see how the other one and this all three are the universal but you see how even compared to the Bernard and we can we can do it this way I think it's easier to see this is a little one 13 14 and this one is the one two Bernard looks a little bit bigger even like this this one's your 13 14 this one's smaller so those are the universal ones then we're going to do our uh, curettes and then this one are the specific area ones so we are going to start with our Gracie one two and I'm going to put it one two because it's like one is first um, this one's more simple and this one's for anterior teeth see this one that guy right there and then I'm going to go to my Gracie five six um, and this one's anterior still because of the simple and we can see right here this Gracie so the G56 how I saw it to compare because yeah we're gonna know because of the name but if we don't if you look at it like this let me get it fine like this I think the one two looks the tiny bit shorter. I don't know if that makes sense. Just the tiniest bit and it would be the same thing with and even this. So let me try to. Put it like that. I think it looks shorter. Even this side, when you look at it, it looks shorter. I don't know if that makes sense. I think this one's a little bit bigger, the terminal, than this one. We can measure it with our probe, but that's what I think of it. See, even if you look at it like this, I think one, two is shorter than this one. Then our five, six. Then we're gonna go with our Gracie. That would be 11, 12, just again, just because it's in order. And then 11, 12. And then we're gonna, then the last one is our 13, 14, which this one is our lacy one because it's only for posterior um, teeth, but the distal side. And how I see it here, because this one looks similar. So, first of all, I know this one is either going to be like an 11, 
12 or 13, 14 because it looks like our Explorer and that's what Miss Corey said. So on here, this one. So if we look at it like this and we try to put it the same. Uh, let me see. Yes. So I feel like I know because this one, since we can use this one for like of the mesial or posterior things and this one is only posterior and distal it, it has more like a curvature like crazy see that and that point in here compared to this guy like it does have it obviously because it's complex and we can use it on our posterior um teeth but it's not as crazy if you compare it and if you see it is like yeah complex but this one has like a point right here this guy and i feel well they're kind of the same i just feel like this one's a tiny bit thicker um but that's how i see it. and i even think let me try to do it correct this one is the tiniest bit shorter than this see but that's how i see it um now i guess i'll show you guys how my thing looks. So my scalar for anterior, this one's posterior right here. And then our probes, um, explorer in the mirror. And then I have, let me turn on the light. Then this is how I fix my other one. Um, so I have my Bernard right here cause he is one or two then the macaw because i don't know just made sense to put it right there um and i think because this one was like um the what was it oh the 17 18 oh my gosh and then the columbia was 13 14 and this one this is the smaller one i think even like to compare it mm, I don't know, even with this crazy one, even though this one is... So this one's the Gracie 1314, and this one is the Columbia. And even then, when you look at it, this one's crazier. Like, this is way thicker, and then we have that point right here compared to this one. And then... And so this is the... So how I see it is, like, this three are my universal ones, this four is specific to whatever i have to do so then in order again one will be my gracie one and two for anterior see like nothing too crazy a little sample then it will be my gracie for anterior and premolars are five six and again if you look at it this from here to here is sh shorter so we know that we can use it for the premolars see how that is a little bit shorter so that's that and then again 11 12 gracie this one is for everything else and then our lazy one would be 13 14 um just posterior and again looks crazy on here compared to this even if i turn around this one the curve is not as pronounced i think as like that point right there hope this helps